Hello friends, I am Sumit Mehta. So in this lecture, we will see how to find the square of any number in three circuits. But for that, there are some prerequisites that we should know the square of numbers till 25. So let's quickly see the squares of number till 25. One square is 1, 2 square is 4, 3 square is 9, 4 square 16, 5 square 25, 6 square is 36, 7 square is 49, 8 square 64, 9 square is 81, 10 square is 100, 11 square this is 121, 12 square is 144, 13 square is 169, 14 square is 196, 15 square is 225, 16 square 256, 17 square is 289, 18 square is 324, 19 square is 361, 20 square is 400, 21 square is 441, 22 square is 484, 23 square 529, 24 square is 576, 25 square is 625. So now let's see the squares of the number between 26 to 75. So for these numbers between 26 to 75, we need to take the base, base equals to 50. Means we will see whether the number is how much lesser than 50 or how much the number is greater than 50. Now let's for example, take, we need to find out the square of 47. But to find out the square of 47, we first need to check whether the number is greater than 50 or lesser than 50 and it is lying in this range. So this 47 is lesser than 50 by 3. So in this case, we will write the deficit. Deficit means how much the number is lesser than 50. It is 0, 3. So what we need to do is we need to do 25 minus 0, 3 square 23 minus 0, 3 plus 0, 3 square so this is 23 25 minus 3 is 22 and 0, 3 square is 0, 9 means we need to write down the last two digits here so the square of 47 will be 2 to 0, 9 Okay, now let's take one more example. Let's we need to find out the square of 43. So 43 is 7 lesser than 50. So what we need to do is 25 minus 7 plus 7 square. So this is 1849. It is clear 25 minus 7 is 18. 7 square is 49. We need we need to write always the last two digits here. Okay, now let's take example of the number greater than 50. Now let's suppose we need to find out the square of 59. So the number is 9 greater than 50. In that need, in this case, we need to add 9 to 25 plus 9 square. So that will be 3, 4, 8, 1. So now let's suppose one more example. Let's suppose we need to find out the square of 73 square. So this is 23 greater than 50. So 25 plus 23 plus 23 square so this is 48 and 23 square as we already know this is 529 so we need to take here the last two digits only and this 5 will get to carry to 48 so this is 5329 So now if the number is between 76 and 125, 
we need to take our base as 100 okay now let's take one example of 81 81 square we need to find out so 81 is 19 less than 100 so in this case we need to subtract from the number itself 81 minus 19 plus 19 square so this is 62 plus 19 square is we know this is 361 but we need to take the last two digits so this will be 6561 this 3 will get to carry add, add up to 62 so now let's take one more example of 93 square so 93 is 7 lesser than 100 so in this case we will subtract 93 minus 7 plus 7 square so this will be 86 49 okay now if the number is greater than 100 now let's suppose we need to find out the square of 113 so what we need to do is what we need to add 113 plus 13 plus 13 square 113 plus 13 is 126 and 13 square is 169 so we need to write here only the last two digits and this one will get to carry to 126 so this is 12769 so now i hope friends you will be clear to how to find the square of any number till 125 and if you like the videos kindly like like us or subscribe in the subscribe button thank you